Hello DVR, I'm Lee Suss, and welcome back to Viscera Cleanup Detail. I was prompted, following my recent waterworks <laughs> escapades, that there was a new level from some bloke called a janitor. Okay, it's called the bank. I think he's just uploaded it, just recently. And just for a change, I'm I'm not like years or months behind, <laughs> so I'm releasing a video. So let's go ahead and do this one. Time to rob this joint. Hold on. <laughs> it conflicted here. It looks a bit messy. I was supposed to be cleaning or robbing the place. I, I don't know. How about if I if I rob it a little bit, but clean it a lot? Is that reasonable? You know, is that okay? Honest, my lord, I was just doing it for for amusement on a YouTube video. I'm, I'm sure that will wash. So I don't know much about this one. Uh, I saw a little tiny bit on the Steam Workshop as I was downloading it, and who knows? It's a janitor level. It could be anything. I'm probably going to get shot by automatic guns at some point. Right, and here we go. Uh, senior workman. John Doe was the last cleaner on shift. What happened to John Doe? He appears John killed everyone. <laughs> okay, crazy. John was a little crazy. Then he, he clocked off, clocked out when an unknown quantity of Omnicorp cash and gold. The filthy swine. That's what I was going to do. It is your duty as the bank cleaner to clean this bank on time before tomorrow. Okay, John isn't still here, is he? I'm, I'm, I'm presuming not. Um, I'm hoping not. Uh, hoping he's... I'm doing it again. I'm doing the wrong controls again. Sorry. <laughs> What's this? Oh, that's gonna keep me awake. Wang's back. It's, it's an old mop. It's John's mop. Mm. They're not going to shut on me and decapitate me, are we? Okay. We've got uh, various dead people here. We've got uh, Uncle Wackleberry. Uh, Janet is doing the... Um, Doing the card PIDs again, which is a jolly good idea. Who's this? Dick Piazzi. Okay. Um, right. Omnicorp. Lots of, lots of droid stuff in here. Does that mean there are droids in here? I mean... Oh, it's a huge one. Look at the size of that. That's a big one. Kind of kind of scary. I mean, they're not so bad when they're little ones. But that's that's a bit terrifying. It, it's, it is... And the, the grippy, the clutching hands, like, it's going to reach down and tear your head off. Nice. There's a little one. That's more like it. That's more like the side we used it. What is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> hazard. Re biohazard. Really? Is this the... Uh... I couldn't even hear you wang over the noise. It's a matter of progress. Is that the gut? Is that the now janitor approved method of disposing of things? That's terrifying. Let's get the display first. A bit blood stain all the way. Right, let's have a look at what we've got around here. We, this is the bank, is it? Omnicorp Collaborative Solutions. That's the, oh, a big pile of bodies over here. Okay, what's this? Can I get through here? Beep, boop, beep, boop. Can I get through here? No, this isn't the vault. Then. What was that? Oh, it's a lift! It's a lift full of crap. Lovely. My favourite kind of lift. What is it through here? This is the to this is the car. See, this is the toilet. Oh, lovely spacious stools. Big John indeed. Oh, you can really you get your your, your mammoth sized butt in there. That's good. Oh, it doesn't want to open. Open, open sesame. Oh, it's pushing. It's it's fighting back. Ah, oh, ah. Uh. We have a problem. Okay, I've recovered. That's a very industrial looking looking clicky job there. Cool. Industrial as chic it is not. Well, oh, it's now it's opening. Okay, fine. I thought we had a bug there for a second. Fine, okay. We've got a toilet. So everything's happening up. That's a very noisy door. All the good stuff's happening upstairs, is it? Fine. Let's um let's knock this away. Oh, these gonna be Yeah, they are gonna be messy. Okay. Let's get rid of the sacks full of body parts. Or whatever the heck this is. I mean, who uses the? Shouldn't this be in the? Shouldn't this be in the service lift or something? Not in the main lift up to the the, the bank floor. I guess we're on cleaning session, aren't we? There's no one supposed to be here. Well, there's no one. A, a rather, there's obviously people here. There's dead bodies here, but this should be the time of day when only the, only the cleaning staff are around. No one should be in the bank. Only us. So it's fair, I guess, that you use the lift to dispose of the rubbish. But anything to get in here, really. It's a very commercial. I mean, it's very really, very. Really, very commercial, isn't it, really, for a bank? There's a lot of adverts around. But there we go. It's Omnicorp 
They owe most of the money probably in the universe. They can do whatever the hell they like. Where's the robots? Are there going to be robot security in here? You know, that's what I'd be thinking really with uh, with Omnicorp, Omnicorp being a main stakeholder in, in Hercules 11 Mechanine Solutions stubborn urban combat situations. <laughs> stubborn. Nice. That's a nice descriptive. Stubborn. You can't... You stubbornly... The, 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 uh, the rebels stubbornly refuse to be removed. You can stubbornly shoot them to pieces with that thing. And this is bigger is better. Unrivaled stopping power in a class 4 titanium chassis. Battle just got big. Oh, good, good job there, marketing. Good job. You're doing, you're doing great. Right. Okay. So we get this out of here. Then we can go and. Ooh. His head bob on again. Because it, it does make me a little sick when it, when it, when it does. Um, preferences. Pick up highlighting. What's that? I never know which one it's under. I don't know. System. I'm just randomly clicking on things. I'm sure it's fine. Right, okay. Let's go up in the lift. A little bit of lag, body my system, rather than the game. Up we go. Hello? Okay. We're up. Of course, very bright. It's very bright in here. Omnicorp, oh, collaborative solutions again. Public <laughs> car protest going on. Pay us, who's that from? Is that from, I can't even remove that. Oh, there's the turrets. How do I get rid of that? Oh, no. Oh, no. No, I don't, I haven't had to deal with the guns in a long time. Access denied. Access denied. Nice, I like it. Um... Hold on, hold on, hold on. What's this? Community credit union. So these are the cash machines. Okay, okay. So some sort of protest was going on. Give us our due. So they said that it was just one guy. Wasn't it? John Doe. John Doe has done all this. Hold on. This is the same map as the... It's a chunk of map from the, um, the Uprising, wasn't it? That's right, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay. I thought it looked kind of familiar. Not all of it. This this bit here is. This bit is different. Is that another grinder? Oh, it's over there. Another grinder's over here. So we, in fact, we've got two levels. Please don't shoot me, Mr. Gun. Yeah. Okay, we've got a gun on the floor here. Put down the weapon, you have 20 seconds to comply. 10 seconds to comply. As they say. No? Okay. Has he got ammo? He has got ammo. What's going to trigger him? What is this? It's the vault. That's going to get me at some point. Like, oh! Loads of money. And what's this? It's latinum. It's pressed latinum. That's what that is. It's not any old gold. Gold's boring. Look at this stuff. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what that thing. It's going to get me at some point. It's going to get me at some point. What's this? Blank paper. There was a sound. It's just general paper storage. Paper storage in general. Okay. I think we're getting the hang of it now. So. I don't really know what the protest is about. Because... We've got a bunch of cleaners. They said it was only John Doe, but there's a whole bunch of cleaners here. <laughs> what is wrong with that title? <laughs> what size? What size butt do you need to have? You just help it fall into that. It's huge. And that, that, shouldn't the toilet bowl be bigger as well? Just a suggestion. Okay. Um, well, we've got two jobs effectively, haven't we? Because we've got a. Hold on, hold on. Ah, hold on a second. So we have no. I didn't see a bin dispenser. We can use this for the for the mopping. Mm. I don't know what that's, when that's going to kick off and kill me. I don't know. Maybe it never will. Maybe it never will. We've got two jobs. We've got a, ah, and there's no real reason 
to mix the two. There's nothing that I can see that's downstairs that is not also available upstairs in terms of resources. The, uh, the, yeah, we've, got the, we've got a dispensing method downstairs, not this, we've got a disposal method downstairs, and we've got bucket dispenser down here. And, um, yeah. Oh, where's the checkout machine, though? Where's, that was back, uh, back over there, wasn't it? Okay, that's back over there. So what's the priority here? So we've got a goddamn mess in the middle here. I think we can be a bit more free and easy, though, because the buckets are easy, and easy to reach over here. A little bit of moppy moppy. There's nothing too... Oh, we've got bo no, we have got bodies. So bodies are the priority. Yeah, because bodies are going to make more mess by me accidentally slapping them on the floor or walking through it, like I have done here. Yeah, that's what's going to be the priority. So we'll get rid of the bodies first. We'll collect up... Hold on. Hold on. Go that way. We'll collect up the PIDs. And then I don't know. Got green lit for this. Did they, did they say that's about being green lit? Mm. <laughs> I thought Steam didn't do green lighting anymore. I don't know. Maybe I misheard that way. I'm not sure. Any more mysteries on the walls around here? Anything surprising around here? No. Nothing too scary. Who's this? Who's this again? This is this is uh, this is Uncle Wackleberry. That sounds like a um uh, an uh, an elf name. A little bit. So this fella can get out of here. The mop, I don't know. John Doe's mop. I don't know if, oh, I don't know if that is uh, rubbish or not, but we'll find out in a minute. <laughs> I'm kind of surprised it isn't making more mess around here. That's fine. Oh, box stacking. Where do we stack? Quiet wank. Where do we stack the boxes? <laughs> it's got a nice echo. <laughs> Let's hope it's completely tuneless. It's got a nice echo. Yeah, so what's happening with the protest then? We've had... Okay, we have had... Um, we've had John, go, John Doe go nuts. And then... We've got a protest upstairs. He, he supposedly robbed the bank, but a lot of money's still there. So he, maybe he's just so much money there that he has actually taken that much. Yeah, see, maybe, maybe he was, uh, the, the, the two things are completely separate, it's just, it's just unfortunate, you know, he gets upstairs, so he, he's got a plan, he's been, he's been cleaning, it's, the temptation's there, okay, he's been cleaning the, uh, the bank absolutely ages, you know, he's been in there, he's had to not only dust, dust the walls and polish the floors, he's had to clean the lathe and everything else, and make sure the, the bank notes are, you know, nicely ironed and all the rest of it, and it's been too much temptation for him. You know, he couldn't. He couldn't take it anymore. He made. He hatched a plan in which to to steal it. Yeah. Is there no container around here in which I can carry these things? I think we're going to use a. Pin. Oh, I think so. That's kind of. I like that. Be kind of good. Yeah. So he hatched a plan in which he was going to run off with some of the money. I mean, he knows the security around the bank. He's here every night. He knows what's going on. He's pretty seen some sort of a loophole. And then, unbeknownst to him. The cleaners are having a protest. Maybe not the cleaners, but maybe a united front of cleaners. There's a whole bunch of cleaners. They've formed a union. That's definitely illegal for a start. They've formed a union, and they're going to protest about cleaning, about cleaning, treatment of cleaning staff in general. Oh, now I feel sick. It's only a bottle of wine. Calm down. And uh, they're all protesting upstairs. He gets up there. He's already challed up. He's already killed at least one person down here, probably. He's killed a bunch of he's killed a bunch of staff down here. You know, he's all he's the adrenaline's rushing around. And then he gets upstairs and what does he find? A bunch of cleaners. Decision time now. I mean, in theory, cleaners are his are his, are, you know, are his fellow brothers and sisters, his compadres. We've got a few of these bins, so I'll probably just chuck this one in. Uh we can put some more stuff in first. There we go. What does he do? How far has he committed himself? I guess he's already gone completely lone wolf. He's decided, you know, he's out for himself only. Forget the protests. He has spread a lot of shells around. That's true. Forget the protesters. He's just going to have to wipe them out as possible, possible, uh, possible witnesses to 
his crime. So he kills the whole bally lot of them, grabs the money and gets out. In the meantime though, how come... Yeah, I afraid that might happen. <laughs> um, I was going to try and pour it in, but it didn't work out, did it? <laughs> uh, in the meantime though, how come the automated gun didn't ace it? Either when he got into the bank illegally, or started with the access in the vault, or when he started killing people. What, what, what is the triggering mechanism for the gun? Is he also an expert hacker and has somehow prevented the security system from killing him? Because he got away! No one said that he... No one said that he... Didn't have a that... that uh, why am I even doing this? It's not going to spray another floor, isn't it? No one said that John Doe was killed. He got away with the cash. I had a protest for So many mysteries. Maybe we'll find out. Okay. Oh, for goodness sake. So how am I going to do this? That's not a viable method before you suggest it. Ah! Choose the edge of the bin spray. Oh, no! Okay. Okay, now this now this is a problem. We have a, we have a spirited bin. A possessed bin. <laughs> it was all going so well, we tried to put it down, and it then uh, accelerated into infinity. What do you find it? Probably won't cause a problem later. I'm sure. You can't hear me having a racket. I'm sorry. It's a very noisy grinder. Goodness, the racket is offensive. Haven't seen where to stack the boxes yet. Oh my god. That one sprayed a bit. <laughs> Haven't seen where to stack the boxes yet. We'll find out in a minute. Uh, that's the key cards. We can do a lot of the work without worrying about it too much, I think, is the answer. But every time is I'm, what I'm worried about is every time I try and feed anything into that machine, help, it's going to spray stuff everywhere, I think is what's going to happen. Which is, of course, Janitor's, Janitor's uh, entire plan all along. It is. He's sitting there sniggering to himself right now. It can't be too easy. Viscera can't Why be too they easy. Make so much mess? I don't know. What's this? This is Gavid Gavid Sendoff. Not David or Gavin. Gavid. Future names. They're a little odd. We've got a we've got a we've got a party over here. Little body party over here. We've got Seamus Wilkes. Who is currently headbutting? Nasty. Who? In you go, Shams. Oh my god, legs first. <laughs> Speed him in. Who's this? Runkle Delwood. Ooh. Come on, Runkle. Would you, would you, would you prefer head, head or feet first? What, what's the, what's the, what's the suggestion? It's head first. <laughs> I should still find that as amusing as I do. But I do. Right. Why is there a... A J-harm over there? I guess I could make a mess on the ceiling. There's not actually any mess on the ceiling right now. Is there? No. Okay, no I think we're dealing with the organics quite well down here, though. It's going to be gone fairly quickly. It's just a matter of then, just a matter, a simple matter, of disposing of all the trash that's around. Haven't seen the laser. No, that might be upstairs. Oh, it's a hand! This is... That's going to keep me awake at night. This is... Which hand is that? I can't remember. I did see that someone, the last person I chucked in the thing, heads first, not feet first, but heads first, was missing a hand. So we need to... T okay, this is very much like dealing with the with the chipping, isn't it? Do you remember? It's been a long time since I've done that level. But I do remember that. No, 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 no. What am I doing? How do you do this again? Not like that. Not like... No, 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 no. 
Are you losing it? No, I don't, I don't. Ah, okay. Mixed up controls, mother game again. I haven't done the uh, the House of Horror level for a very long time. Haven't felt the need. There's so many other good maps out there made by the colour people like Janitor that there's no real need to. But I um, I do remember that the shredder could be a little tricky. He did tend to spray things around, but the shredder had the benefit of having. Um, the sort of baffle around it that, that, that uh, prevented the various parts from spraying out quite so much. This does not. And therefore will cause some problems. We'll just chuck these bits out there. We'd have to frisbee them in there, wouldn't we? Can you have that mechanic in there? Somebody? And a mechanic where you can frisbee the, uh, the bin bits. Hi, Bruce. The Zeus from across the room. Mm. Okay, I think we should probably just dispose of these toilet rolls. She's a bit of a shame, a bit wasteful. Never mind, I'm gonna clean the place. Still better trying to clean these up than stacking them in house paper. That's a bit too frustrating. I've been watching that, that's uh there was a bunker level where I had to supply various things of other people, the nutters who thought the world was gonna end. And we're getting ready for it, the preppers. And uh, they didn't actually seem very bothered about toilet rolls. It wasn't one of the things on their list compared to food and um, and drink, which is kind of crazy because, well, they are crazy people. But where's that buzzing? Because oh god, you know toilet roll pretty important as well. Oh for goodness sake! You'll be happy when you know you know when the. When you're out in the world after the apocalypse, and um, the only thing you've got to use is a, is a handful of grass or some dry leaves or something. Maybe, maybe wet leaves rather than rather than rather than rather than dry leaves. A bit better on your bottom. Is it a camera? Oh, it's a camera. Oh, camera in the toilet. Well, it is Omnicorp, I guess. You know, they just get around these things. I don't think you're actually allowed to put cameras in toilets, are you? What's what's the law on that? I'm not absolutely certain. It's probably not very accepting though of cameras in toilets. <laughs> Unless you've got a really good reason. I guess it's not a hidden camera. It's a minor plus, but hold on a second, what does this say? Relief suite. On off turbo mode. Turbo mode. Uh, police are that's for cleaning your hands and not for how the toilet works. Hold on. Right, I just noticed that the toilet holder is holder is uh, he's empty. It's just a thought. I mean, you know, it's the sort of thing that janitors have to do. They're all empty. Why would you do that? Why would you come in here and just throw the toilet rolls everywhere? It's a quite of a low value protest, isn't it? Really, but <laughs> there you go. It's a protest of sorts. Of oh my goodness. And why did why did uh, why did John 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 Doe come in here anyway? Whoa, that's a bad toilet seat. It's a spooky toilet seat. Calm. <laughs> what was that noise? <laughs> Let's get this guy out. And we'll try and deal with the with the spookums toilet seat. I guess John was in here was in here to uh, to make sure there were no witnesses. He searched through the toilet as well. This poor oh the toilet seat's settled down. Hopefully, uh, oh this can of beer. <laughs> Gek Lamarck was having a quiet. It's the only way you can get to the day. It's for several beers on the toilet. <laughs> poor guy. Is that was there a bin or something around here that I was using? I thought oh it's right here, isn't it? Of course, it's right here. Let's get rid of these beers in here. We're going to try and pour these into the machine again in a minute. Oh, even the bins are just not behaving properly, are they really? Poor guy. Just so you're having a squat. A squat and a... He's, he's trousers when he's around his ankle. For this shit. So, he was presumably just having a drink. And not a dump as well. If you were to die on the toilet, would you rather... 
Oh, it's got some seashells there, look. Would it, would it matter really if you were being killed and you, for your own personal uh, feelings, will never come out of the carpet. if there's no carpet, if, uh, if you were killed in the toilet and you had your trousers around your ankles or not, it would be worse. Why can I not get out of the room? This thing's good. Okay, there we go. I'd have thought with these big toilets that things would be easier. But apparently not. Okay, there we go. That also appears to be the only toilet with the three seashells. All the others, that's uh, thinking of these Gex uh, personal toilet. It's really executive. Oh! oh. I was kind of hoping I could have fed that in without physical. 